be a hotel that sat here. And this was the hotel that Malcolm X stayed in when he came and gave a speech on February 14th, 1965, one week before he was assassinated. It's called The Last Message. He stayed here at this hotel the day after his house was firebombed. Statler Hilton okay. Don't and So this is um village land in this district. Fox Theater City Canada has their festival at the same time that Detroit has theirs. And then they do the fireworks and the international fireworks on both of them. Now is it um true that you're working on a book or was it a movie or oh, it's a book. For me it's a book. Yeah, it's called Black. <laughs> it's called Blacks Before it's called Black Before Bankruptcy. Um, the the most important sites in the building of Black Detroit. So that's what it is. So it's not gonna be like a chronolo chronological history starting from 1701 to 1974. It's gonna be the particular sites, some of which we've seen today. Particular sites and what happened at those sites and who were the people involved at those particular important historic sites. And so it's a story of places and the people and events involved with those places. Okay. And so it'll so start. It, that sounds really similar to the tour. Tutorial. Yeah, it starts, but it's not going to be just Underground Railroad. Uh, That's the difference. Okay. It'll be, yeah, Underground Railroad will be included, but so will the rebellions, the riots, so called riots. So will the marches for civil rights, and so will, so a lot of other stuff will be going, will be in there besides just the Underground Railroad. Okay. But yeah, the Underground Railroad, the Nation of Islam found, all of that will be. In there, the Republic of New Africa, Malcolm X giving um, three major speeches in Detroit, message to the grassroots, ballad of the bullet, and the last message, which was done at Hart Plaza at Ford Auditorium, which no longer exists. But he gave that speech one week before he was assassinated. So those kind of things, man.